Lily, thanks for joining us at St Andrews. How pleased are you to sign your new deal ahead of turning 18? Yeah, I'm really excited. Obviously, this club's basically my home now. I've been here since I was really young and I can't wait to get started. I guess it is extra special. You're telling me you trialled at nine, joined the RTC at 10. So to have that progression and then continue it into full time and in the WSL must be really, really nice. Yeah, it's really like a proud moment for me and my family because we've gone all the way through and we've seen girls drop out, we've seen girls not make it, but we've stuck to it and we've made it here. And I think my main aim is just to be the inspiration for the other girls of the RTC to show that you can make it all the way through at this club and there is a clear pathway. What better platform to do that? Where we're sat today in St Andrews, where you're going to be playing your home games this season. How excited is that? Yeah, I think that's a massive step for the club and get the fans back in the stadium. I mean, the pitch is insane as well and it'll be a really good boost for the women's game. And it's a bit of a, it feels like a bit of a new era, I guess, with the, the moving into the stadium and, and the new head coach. Have you had a chat with him yet? Yeah, I've had a couple of phone calls with him and he's a really good guy, really passionate about the club, he's going to fight, wants to win games, wants to send us to that next level. So, yeah, we're all really excited to get back into training, meet him and find out more about him. And another ingredient this season, not a new one, but one coming back is the fans. I guess that's extra special for them to be here and obviously you being in the team. Yeah, I'm excited for the fans to come back. It's been a long time without them. We see their support on social media and we miss them. And they're coming back to St Andrews, home of Birmingham, so it'll be good.